Hi everyone, I'm here again with Nicole, the gut girl. Thanks for being with us, Nicole. Thank you for having me. You know, I like it when we talk about supplements. We're going to talk about magnesium and vitamin D, two huge ones for me, definitely in my top five. Um, two things that I personally take every day and trying to get, you know, in the best form. But um, let's, you, you were telling me before we turn this on that it's important that these two things work together. And they probably work together with the other minerals and fat soluble vitamins also. But first tell us about magnesium. So magnesium and vitamin D together, it's, it's kind of like the big rage right now on all the social media platforms. So I kind of wanted to go in and do a little bit of a different take along the same lines because magnesium and vitamin D are two essential, essential nutrients that actually aid in the function together for our organs in our body. So that is a really big thing that one aids the other and one not more than the other. So really what this kind of boils down to now is that magnesium, when you are deficient, I see in my practice about 99% of people are deficient in vitamin D and magnesium, but you need to get them together so that you can, so that they aid in all those functions together with the organs. Magnesium assists the activation of vitamin D, and it also helps with the uptake of calcium. So that's really important for bone health, especially as we age. Um, you know, if somebody comes into my office and they're vitamin D deficient, which is a lot of the time nowadays tested for, but they don't test magnesium, I'm going to give them magnesium and vitamin D together because if you're low in D, then nine times out of 10, you're low in magnesium. Um, the deficiency in these two together can cause cardiovascular disease. It can cause metabolic syndrome, which just is a fancier word to say your immune system at a cellular level is, is really compromised. Um, it's also when you see it's a cancer reduction. So people who have good levels of this, you don't see often having cancer. And that's very, very important. It also, the two of these two things together, also activates your kidney and liver enzymes. So that is where, you know, your liver is where everything transfers over and, and flows out to the body, for lack of better terms. Um, and that's what you want to be happening. When somebody has high liver and kidney enzymes with me, I'm going to check their magnesium and vitamin D levels. Okay, so we know that magnesium plays a role in, I'm not the scientist here, but like hundreds of things, right? Yes. I mean, and um, vitamin D does also, but what you're saying is the, all the things that you can read about that vitamin uh, D does and all the things that you can read about that magnesium does, they're kind of synergistic, right? So they Absolutely. kind of work together. And then you can read about all the things that vitamin D does and they're different things, but they kind of trigger each other. Oh, for sure. Uh, now, what about, I know that vitamin D, you also want vitamin K, correct? For sure. Yes. I take a vitamin D3 with a K in the same supplement. And that's important because it, it's like if you're missing one of these things, you're putting a monkey wrench in the whole system, right? Absolutely. You know, one of the things that I do on my clients is um, if you have anything like and if I see a wide range of things going on, I'm going to do a mineral and a vitamin and mineral test on you because that will also tell us where you're, where each and every crook is coming in and stealing from you so that we know why and what we need to put back in with also kind of digging to see why that's depleted in your body. All right. So everyone, Nicole's just talking about the importance of, um, vitamin D working with magnesium, but that doesn't mean to disregard the other fat soluble vitamins, right? 
Oh, for sure. And okay. and all the other minerals. Yeah. Okay. Now that's D and K. There's only two more, you know, A, right? Right. You know, so you got um, A, D, E, K, and now you got them all. So. Right. Uh, and you need to see why you don't have those. If, you know, and if you're, you know, having some weird symptoms and you're, and you can't get, you know, back onto the mend, I would check these fat soluble vitamins, also your minerals. If you have anxiety problems, asthma, um, irregular heartbeat, some things that you wouldn't tie to this kind of thing, that is all signs of magnesium deficiency. If you have an autoimmune condition, nine times out of 10, you have a D deficiency. Um, if you have high blood pressure, you should be checking your vitamin D. Yeah. It's fascinating to understand how all these things work together. So Nicole, how do people get a hold of you if they want to get a consultation from you or whatever? And also if they mention this video, you'll give them a hundred dollars off their initial consultation where you Absolutely. read their blood work, you read their blood work and everything, right? Yes. The first initial consult is reading blood work. I go over all your health history um, and we tie symptoms with your labs. Sometimes symptoms are overriding labs, that kind of stuff. But I will deep dive into all of that. And yes, of course, if you mention this video, you will get a hundred dollars off. Okay. How do they get a hold of you? You can reach me at the gut girl one at gmail.com. And you can also reach me on any social media platform from the gut girl. Okay. That's the gut girl one. That's the number one. So thank you for being with us, Nicole. Thank you for having me.